Hello guys, I'm Matt, and I'm doing the uh, vacation review on the Fenwick. And uh, right now we're at the Vista rooftop and we're going to do the review. Okay guys, my name is Shaman and I'm going to be the interviewer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready for your first question? Yeah. All right. Is the motel pet friendly? Yes, it is. What time is check-in or check-out? Check-in is at uh, 4 o'clock in the afternoon and check-out is 11 the next day. Do they offer early check-in? No. Is the motel handicap accessible? Yes. Were the employees helpful? Very helpful. Was the staff friendly? The staff is very, very friendly. Was the clientele friendly and well-mannered? Yes, they were. Was it easy to carry your luggage in? Yes. Were their luggage carts readily available? Yep. Were they easy to use? Very easy to use. How far away did you have to park? Mm, 50 feet. Were the beds comfortable? Very comfortable. What type of AC or heat did the room have? Uh, Amanda. Uh, how easy was it to use? Very easy. And uh, how well did it work? Very nice, very cool in the room. Uh, what was the shower like? The uh, shower worked for extremely well. Was the water hot enough? Yep, very hot. Uh, was it safe? Were there safety bars and any safety equipment in the shower? Yeah, there was only one safety bar to the side, and uh, it has a uh, skid-free flooring on it. Did they have sufficient washcloths and towels? Yes, they had uh, quite a few. Yeah. Was the room and bathroom clean? Very clean. How often did room cleaning come in and were they courteous? Yeah, they came in every day and uh, they were very courteous. Did they disturb you and how well did they clean your room? Uh, they did not disturb us at all and they cleaned it extremely well. Was it a quiet, relaxed environment? Yeah, very uh, relaxed and very quiet. Was the property surrounding the motel nice? Yep, and in all the directions it was very nice. What type of complimentary bath products were in the room? Infusion. Okay, there was shampoo? There was shampoo, there was conditioner, and then there was a body... Uh, body bar? So, yeah. Body, and, and some kind of makeup wipe. Yeah. Right? Okay. Um, what type of complimentary coffee, coffee cups, or et cetera were in the room? different uh, K cups and uh, they had decaf also and they had uh, uh, complimentary cups snap tops and they had uh, uh, sugar and uh, stirs and, stuff. and creamers inside and the packets and creamer packs, yeah. then uh, they had like the other types of cups as well in plastic yeah was there a coffee maker in the room uh, yes it was just a K cup but not a regular coffee maker right um, was there an ice cooler in your room? Yes. Was it clean? Very clean. What type of TV was in the room? Samsung 49 inch. Oh. Was there a microwave and refrigerator in the room? Not in the room, but 15 feet away there was. A community microwave. Yeah, community. And in the room there was a refrigerator, correct? Right, it was a Hamilton Beach refrigerator. Was there a freezer? No. Okay, but it was a, a pretty big fridge. Yes. Um, how well did they work? It was extremely well. Kept uh, all our uh, sodas and teas and water. Nice and cold. Nice and cold. Was there an ice maker? Uh, 15 feet away. How well did it work? Very well. Uh, was the refrigerator and microwave clean? Yes. Was there a closet or a place to hang your clothes? place to hang your clothes and then they had uh, dresser drawers. Okay, was it nice? Uh, very nice. Uh, did they have an ironing board and an iron? They had an ironing board, but the uh, ironer you had to request it at the desk. Okay. Um, was there a safe in your room? No safe. Is there a laundry facility available on premises? Uh, yes, there are. What type of soda or snack vending machines were there? Uh, they had a, a little store there where you can buy uh, your sodas and um, ice cream and stuff like that. Okay. 
and just other convenience items. Yes. And uh, so, like novelties for the pool and beach. Okay, was there an arcade and what was it like? Okay, the arcade was taken out for room for more of the uh, office equipment, but right next door, probably like 50 feet away is an arcade, and the arcade is very, very nice. Okay, and was the motel busy? Uh, the motel was busy. Is there a restaurant or a lounge to eat at inside the motel premises? Yeah, it's the Vista Rooftop uh, restaurant. How would you describe the menu? Uh, mostly seafood. Mostly seafood and... Um, not kid-friendly. Yeah, not kid-friendly. <laughs> um, do they offer alcoholic beverages? Yes. Um, was there a gift shop on premises? No. Um, you'd have to go for to the boardwalk to get good. Uh, yes. Okay. Um, were there snack or convenience shops? Yes. And one we just talked about. Yes. Uh, was there a pool, hot tub, or spa? Uh, pool and a hot tub. And then the kids splash park the little yeah, area there. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah. Uh, were there restrooms located near the pool? Yep. Were the restrooms clean? Yes, they were. Was the pool or hot tub or spa clean? Yes. Uh, how well was the water chlorine level maintained? Uh, every morning they uh, check the uh, chlorine level. Did they have pool towels available? Yes. Was there a key or key card? Yes. A key or key card? Key card. How easy was it to <laughs> use? Very easy to use. Is there a free breakfast? Yes, there is a free breakfast. What was available to eat or drink at breakfast? Okay, you have uh, vitamin D milk, regular, low fat. You had yogurts, you had cream cheese and butter, you had bagels, you had uh, oatmeal, you had pancake maker there. But the, it was a little slow. Very, very slow making. But the pancakes were good. Yep. And then you had um, muffins, different ones. You had uh, blueberry and you had uh, banana and banana. Nuts. Yeah, they were pretty good. And then you had apples there, bananas. Cereal. They have Rice Krispies and uh, Frosted Flakes. What was to drink? Uh, you have all different juices. Apple juice, orange juice. Apple juice, orange juice. I think there's cranberry. cranberry. Yeah. And water. And water. And you, you can make hot tea and hot water. Yeah. And tea bags. And you had the coffee. You had the cappuccino machine. You hot, had chocolate. hot chocolate. You could get. Okay. Very good. All right. Okay, Matt, how many pillows were provided in your room? Uh, three per bed. And there were two beds, so that's six pillows. Yeah. Uh, was the bedding material satisfactory? Very, yeah, very nice. Do they offer room service? Yes. What is nearby to eat? And what places of interest are nearby? Okay, they have uh, cheesesteaks. Mm -hmm. They had uh, pizza across the street. They have uh, Chinese next door. Had um, the noodle place. Uh, Holy Mac. Holy Mac. Yeah, that was really fun. That's you gotta go there. That's a really nice place. Yeah, we ate there. It was really good. Yeah, and then we have the uh, Five Guys down the street as well. Yeah. Okay, and there was a pizzeria that had uh, cheese steaks and pizza and things. Yeah. It's a the street. Near the arcade. Yeah. Right, okay. Um, was there transportation available? Yes. Uh, what kind of transportation? Uh, you have the city bus. It goes all the way to the inlet, to the boardwalk. You ride all day on a, on a single pass. Just, uh, How much is the pass? Four dollars a day. Okay. And is there other transportation available, like shuttles and? They have Uber here. And the Fenwick uh, van. The Fenwick van takes you, take you right to the uh, 139th Street beach. Uh, beach, back and forth. And what about the Bethany Beach? Is there transportation there? Okay, Bethany Beach. Uh, a trolley, right? They have a trolley there. And you could ride. Does that cost money to ride? No, it's free. Very good. Okay. Um, do they do tours on that? No, it's just basically you ride around, you can see anything you want to see for free.
through. They said it's like a 45 minute ride? Yeah, 45 minutes. That goes all the way around to their inlet and back. Okay. Um, are there shops nearby to shop in? Yes. And um, how would you describe the shops? Like a, a traditional like boardwalk type store? Oh, yeah. The novelties, like t-shirts and... Oh, yeah. It was fabulous. You could get lost in all them stores. You could, you could buy the boogie boards, but there was also a place to rent them yeah. in case you didn't want to buy them. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, how would you describe the menus where you ate, and was there a long wait to be seated? No, I usually you sit right down in the places we went, and uh, not a long time for the food. The food was... Uh, Boardwalk style food, so the most stuff was eight dollars and up. So we had like hot dog. We had uh, board. They did not have the interesting thing was there was no funnel cakes on the boardwalk. You had to get funnel fries, funnel fries. and they were good. They were good. They were really good. Yeah. And then the onion rings, they were good as well. Yeah, boardwalk style and boardwalk fries were good. And then we had the core K O R S or H S. Yeah, um, the, the ice cream. Yeah, that was really good. You have to eat it fast because it melts real fast. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was, uh, I believe it was Polish water ice. It was very creamy. Oh, that was fabulous. Yeah. That was really good. They have all different types there. You can get beside the, the cherry. They had all kinds, like the rainbow ones, and it was crazy. And, and the cheeseburger and the cheesesteak were really good extremely good. They're in the 15 to 20 dollar category though. They, they, they're a little bit pricey out there. All right. But they were good. Sounds great. Okay, Matt, that, uh, that concludes our interview session. Yeah. Um, I'll give you some free time if you, there's anything on your mind yeah. that you think might be helpful that you want to share with the Thomas family. Yeah. Uh, I thank you guys for uh, letting us do this for you. Uh, we had a very nice time here. Everybody was good here. The, the pool was extremely nice. You were really going to like that. And the hot tub and the splash pool for the kids, it's really good. The beach is nice because it's not really overloaded with people. And the shuttle will take you there and back. And then you have the uh, uh, outside uh, shower where you can watch all so you don't bring the sand back in. And it's really nice. The guys here are really nice. When you want to leave the beach, all you do is uh, call on the cell phone and he comes right there right away. They're you just call the front desk, right? Yeah, you call the front desk and they'll send the shuttle right away for you. So That's it's really cool. nice and the uh, boogie boards and the uh, chairs and stuff right there at 139th they have a place just around from here right on the beach so it's easy, easy to do. What was your experience in did you go down to the beach and did you notice any like special things like sunrises? Oh yeah, the sunrise. You have to get up very early in the morning. You go out to the beach. It's very uh, relaxing, very beautiful. You'll see the sun come up. It's all different colors and pinks and lavender. If you guys like taking photographs, it's a great photo yeah, opportunity. Yeah, very good time. To take take pictures with the family. And beautiful. Then, then you'll see the uh, sunrise come right on up and it's very Unbelievable. And one piece of advice that you had for them Matt, was to make sure that if you get up early for breakfast, because it fills up quick and then there's lines, yeah. you want to get there early, guys. Get there at seven on the dot because yeah, there's people waiting for it to open. Yeah, they do. Yeah, man. That was your piece of advice I know you shared with me. Yeah. So, <laughs> all right. Is that everything or you got anything else you yeah, want to that's say? Everything. That's everything. All right. Say bye. 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 We hope you have a wonderful time on your vacation. Yeah, we appreciate it. Yeah, we appreciate your business.